What's going on, Bella Gang? Welcome back to my channel. In today's Juicy Girl Talk video, I'm going to be putting you ladies on to how to have top tier feminine hygiene. I'm talking about your man is going to be like, wait, wait, hold up, because how is it that you never have an off day down there? Like, you always smell good. Your body, your kitty, like, what is, he's really going to be wondering, like, what the hell happened? Okay, no shade, but, you know, a lot of you guys been writing me, sis, help me, you know what I'm saying? I'm a little insecure about this. Girl, this is a sisterhood. There's no reason why you should feel any type of shame. Some people weren't taught. It's okay. That's why you have your fairy godmother over here to spill all the tea, okay? So sit back, relax, get you some drinks, get you a snack, because I'm going to put you guys on to tips that's literally going to elevate your feminine hygiene, okay? From a 10, maybe you probably had good hygiene before, but now it's going to be like, I'm talking about from a 10 to a 20. Without further ado, let's jump right into this video. Oh, I can't wait to share with you guys, ladies these tips. You see, I'm, I'm over here tongue-tied because I'm so passionate about this. Oh, but let me just say, after you watch this video, I promise you, your hygiene, your feminine hygiene is never going to be the same again. I promise. Now, let's get started. Okay, Bella Gang, boom. Coming in at number one, how to have top-tier feminine hygiene. Number one, this is super important. If you want to walk out the shower squeaky clean, okay? I'm talking about you smell your skin. Your skin smells like you already put like a hundred layers of perfume, then the key is stop using body wash, okay? There's nothing wrong with body wash. I used to use body wash all the time, but I noticed that I smelled extra good, extra sweet, extra juicy when I switched over from body wash to bar soap. And not just any bar soap, and no, this is not sponsored, but the Irish Spring Original, the original clean scent one, use that instead of body wash. You can find that Irish Spring um, soap bar from your local Dollar Tree, okay? So, and let me just put you on to something. I feel like a lot of people think for you to have top tier feminine hygiene, you have to, you know, break the bank and spend all this much money on a specific type of body wash. No, Irish Spring is going to get you, I'm, I promise you, I promise you, after you watch this video, go walk over to your local CVS, Walgreens, Dollar Tree, and I want you to shower with, uh, and use the Irish Spring bar soap and tell me how you feel after. Your skin literally feels squeaky clean. You do not have to break the bank to smell good, okay? Now, coming in at number two, how to have top tier feminine hygiene. Ladies, this is something that I feel like goes above a lot of people's heads, even mine, okay? Um, okay, so number two, this is even more important than number one, okay? More important than number one. It's very important. When you wash your clothes, make sure that you're washing your clothes in a fragrant, scented laundry detergent and a fragrant, scented um fabric softener this is why okay so me personally i love gain i know they say that gain and downy is not it's not good for you like health wise I, that's what i'm hearing i don't know that's what i'm hearing but your girl uses that i use the gain i forgot which brand i forgot which brand it is but if I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna share a, a picture right here if, if I find it on the internet. But I use a Gain Tropical Scented Laundry Detergent, and I use this brand of Downy. Once again, not sponsored. But I noticed that when I wash my clothes with the detergent and the fabric softener, right? My clothes smell so good. So when someone goes to hug you, they're like, "Ooh, what's that smell? Like, what perfume are you wearing?" Whole time it's just Gain and fabric softener. <laughs> Like, for real. Like, I'm telling you, ladies, if you take a shower with the Irish Spring Bar Soap, right? And then when you put on your clothes, your clothes smell really good from the laundry detergent. I'm telling you, like, I'm, I will never forget. I will, I will never forget this. I was working. When I was working at a restaurant, I had a friend, and she always smells so good when she walked by. And I'm like, girl, what are you wearing? She was like... I didn't even, I forgot to put um, perfume on. I'm like, what? So why you smell so good? She was like, oh, it's probably my clothes. Like I, when it comes to, um, I, I, what did she say? She just, she like, she, she, 
I'm over here tongue tied. I'm so excited to tell you guys all of this tea, okay? But yeah, she just uses, you know, laundry detergent. You know, that smells really good. Like the fabric softener and the laundry detergent. I forgot which one she, she used, but I know for me, I use Gain and Downy together. Smells so good. So I promise you, like, it's and it's very important. It's very important. You can spray perfume all you want, but if your clothes smell rank and it smells like it don't smell good, then, you know, that perfume you're wearing is going to wear, wear off and you're going to start smelling like old gym socks, okay? So it's very important. Just be very mindful when you're washing your clothes. You know, have some fragrance in the in your clothes, okay? So it can smell really good. So when you put it on, you walk by, you, you hug someone, they just, they you know, they, they smell the um, scents off your clothing. And, you know, and I don't know about y'all, but... It's something about a person that smells good. I don't care. Like a guy can literally be like a six and he will instantly be like an eight, nine to me. I feel like it's very important as a woman to like smell your best. And uh, I feel like a lot of people struggle with feminine hygiene because they they just, they forget to do these um, crucial but simple steps. So make sure the next time you go and purchase your laundry detergent, keep what I said in mind. Get you a laundry, laundry detergent that smells really good, okay? And you don't have to put that much either. You, you Like, follow the instructions, but just make sure that it has fragrance to it, okay? Coming in at number three. This is something that goes hand in hand with number one. I said this in another feminine hygiene video, but I have to say it again because it's super important. If you want to... If you want your skin, not, you know what I'm saying, not, not just for you to smell good, but your skin to be smooth and, you know, <sighs> exfoliating gloves. The other day, I went to Target. I got me some ex exfoliating gloves. One thing about me, I do not use wash rags. I do not use anything but ex exfoliating gloves. I discovered these shower gloves a few years ago, and I've never stopped showering with them ever since. Um... This is something that you have to experience. I can even tell you the benefits. You have to really experience it, experience it, but you go, okay? Get your exfoliating gloves. You get your Irish Spring um, bar soap, lather it all up with the gloves, and then just go to town on your body. Scrub all over your body. Once you, once you step out the shower, not only are you gonna smell really good from the bar soap, but your skin, you're gonna feel a difference. Like your skin is gonna be soft. If you, if you guys can see, as you guys can see, okay? Skin is soft okay it is very very soft i remember my ex told me he was like oh this is why you smell good i put him on to the gloves like i'm telling you the exfoliate the exfoliating gloves got some magic in it like i don't know what but i feel like everyone should be using exfoliating gloves like those shower gloves are amazing for the skin for the body you feel clean and then but also this is very important I, I usually purchase like a big pack from Amazon. It's like, it comes 12 in a pack for about $12.99. I'm not sure. I'm going to leave the, the link for you guys in the description box if I if I find it. But um, make sure, me, I always take, I always um, go into the shower with two sets of gloves. One for my body and one for my kitty. Okay. One for, okay. One for my body. Wait. No, I my bad i mean some people might think this is a little excessive but i have one ex three exfoliating gloves i shower with one for my body okay one for my kitty and one from my booty okay do not use the exfoliating gloves for your whole body because you're gonna stink like imagine like think about it imagine you so lathering your body up you scrubbing your body now that same glove that you used to open your booty cheeks to wash and clean you now you now uh, uh, showering your whole body with the same glove that you use on your booty. You gonna step out the shower smelling like booty meat. Like what? Don't do that. Okay, it's not sanitary. I, it's very important if you want to smell really, really good, especially for those intimate moments, ladies, that you have with your man. Okay, make sure this is very important. Don't mix gloves because it's gonna throw your pH balance off. Especially, do not use um, exfoliating gloves that you use on your booty, on your kitty. Okay, you're just begging for a UTI, not a UTI, BV. Okay, because BV is caused by bacteria. That's what it's called, bacteria vaginosis, and you do not want that. It's gonna create a fishy smell, and you're gonna walk around uh, uh, um, insecure about how your your box smell, all because you mixed up the the booty shower gloves 
gloves with the coochie shower gloves. So don't do that, okay? Um, moving forward, you ladies, how to have top tier feminine hygiene. This is so important. I cannot stress this enough. Every time you go to use the restroom, this is something I said in, in another feminine hygiene video, but I have to say it again for, for the women who hasn't watched that video because that video was like years ago. Um, very important. If you want your coochie to smell immaculate like water all day long, you want to keep it fresh all day long. I know this is something that's tedious and annoying to have to keep doing, but I promise you, if you do this, your kitty will not have not one smell. I know someone on um, on TikTok said, you know, um, every now and then your coochie going to smell like it is what it is. Like, you know. I have to, I, I beg to differ. I beg to differ. I'm, I'm a living testimony about that, okay? I'm telling you. I mean, I'm not, not to have two, two TMI, but before, you know, your girly became celibate, all right? <laughs> Listen, let me tell you something. I feel like the best compliment I ever got was, girl, you taste good and your coochie always smell good. You never have a bad day. Like, for a man to tell you that, you know, you know you have top tier feminine hygiene. So I'm telling you this from experience, okay? From the feedback I receive from my exes, okay? <laughs> okay? Always, every time you go to the bathroom, you get, if, even if you're out, get you a bottle of water, put it in your bag. But if you're home, have a cup nearby where you, you know, you turn on your sink, fill it up with cold water, and then you wash your kitty every time you go and pee, right? Now, if you have to do number two, don't just wipe your booty with toilet tissue. It's dirty. It's still dirty. It has, all you're doing is smearing, okay, leftover feces on your the, your booty cheeks. You might not see it, but it's there and it smells, okay? If you, if you just think about it, if you poop, let's say you poop all day, at the end of the night, right, you come home, Smell your booty. It's not going to smell good. It's not going to smell good. You might throw up, okay? So you need to take the toilet tissue, you know, wipe first with toilet tissue. Make sure that, you know, you wipe until you see nothing on the toilet tissue. Then you go in with some baby wipes. One thing about me, I always have baby wipes. If I don't have baby wipes where I'm at, I hold it until I get home, okay? Until I get home before I make number two in public, okay? Because number one, once you, when you use baby wipes, you're going to feel really comfortable. You're going to feel, it's going to, it's going to make you feel really clean. Okay. It's very sanitary. And then on top of that, um, yeah, you don't have to worry about your booty stinking. <laughs> you don't have to worry about that. Okay. Because you wipe properly. Some people think like toilet tissue is enough. Baby girl is not enough. It's not enough, okay? So always have some baby wipes and make sure that the baby wipes are fragrance-free. You don't want any wipes with any type of fragrance on it because it's going to irritate your skin. Down, it's going to irritate it down there, so you don't, you don't want to do that. And very important, you're probably like, okay, I get it, sis. But what do you do? What do you wash your kitty cat with? This is very important. I've said this time and time again. My favorite go-to soap for down there. Oh, and this is very important. I forgot to mention this. Please, if you're going to go and use the bar soap, the Irish Spring soap, just use that on your body alone. Do not use that soap um, on your kitty because, number one, it's going to burn because of the, 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 the fragrance in it. It's going to burn. It's going to irritate. It's going to get red, bumpy, and you're going to blame me and say, oh, my gosh, I took your advice, and now my coochie's on fire. Don't do that. Disclaimer. The, the bar soap, the iris spring is for your body, okay? Now, as far as your kitty cat goes, I use two products, right? Um, so I use the Monistat, I use the Monistat um, Feminine Wash, and I use the Dove Sensitive Skin. You know what's crazy? These company, uh, uh, listen, Dove, iris spring, if y'all watching, please cut me a check. Please come here and check, because I'm giving all this free promo, but honestly, they deserve the free promo because these products... I'm telling you, have me have it smelling good, good, okay, tasty, yummy, <laughs> all right? But um, I use the Dove Sensitive Soap. Honestly, like, I use Monistat once in a blue. If I if the sensitive skin, uh, the Dove Sensitive Skin is not available, I use the Monistat. But um, the Dove Sensitive Skin, it has no fragrance in it. It's not going to irritate you down there. I've been using it for years, and 
I didn't even know this, but um, gynecologist actually recommends the Dove Sensitive Skin for your kitty. And I did not know that. I've been using that for years. And I just, I just, I just, the reason why I use it is because it's, I, it doesn't irritate me. It doesn't burn. It, it leaves my kitty smelling so good. Yes, one, judge me, don't judge me. But one thing about me, to make sure that it's really clean, I, I go in there with my fingers and little sniff test. Like, one thing about me, ain't nobody gonna tell me your coochie thing. Ain't nobody gonna tell me that. Cause I'm gonna test it. One thing about me, I'm gonna test it. Period. <laughs> okay, cause no, 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 no. I think that's the worst thing a man could say about you. Is like, oh, like she cute, but she stank down there. That's the worst. That's the worst. All right, I'd rather somebody call me ugly child and say your coochie stink. What? No. Um, so pretty much Bella gang, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was useful for you ladies. Oh, another thing, let's do a little recap and I'm going to add one more tip for you ladies. So step one, step one, go and purchase shower gloves, exfoliating gloves. You can find them at Target, TJ Maxx, Dollar Tree has them, um, Amazon has them, and then you want to get you the Iris Spring Bar Soap. You lather the soap up with the um, gloves and then you scrub your body just like this with the gloves. Scrub it all the way, but do not put it on your kitty or do not put it on your backside either. Just for your body, your thighs, your inner thighs, whatever. After you rinse that off, go in with the Dove Sensitive, Dove Sensitive Skin Soap. You lather the soap up in your hands and then you... Okay, spread them lips and get them that soap in between. Okay, don't just go up and down. You gotta spread it. That's where the that's where a lot of people, a lot of women say like, oh, I don't know. I I take a shower, but it still stink down there. Cause girl, you you scared of your own coochie. You need to get in there. Like you need to open one leg up and get in there. Okay, period. Get in there, lather it up, wash it up. And then for the back door, same thing. Use Dove Sensitive Skin for the for your booty. Open up them booty cheeks and really get in there. Also, this is another tip for those of you who say, oh my gosh, I always wash my booty, but it still stinks. Girl, you need to spread them booty cheeks, apply the Dove Sensitive Soap in between the cheeks and put and take your finger, not all the way in, but, you know, go inside the hole a little bit. Okay, with the with the with the gloves, go inside. Okay, then rinse it out. Like that's how you, you know, what I'm saying you you have good hygiene in the back door. Okay, for those of you who do not know, don't just go, oh, just don't just wash in between the cheeks, and that's it. You gotta get inside a little bit too. And it's crazy because I I, I randomly um I, I seen a clip of Cardi B, and um, she was saying how when she washes her booty, you know, she was like, I take my, you see my, you see my finger, I take and I put it all the way in there to clean myself. And once again, this is something that I thought I'm, I'm the only one who did it. Like she said it herself. She, that's how she keeps it clean. Like she goes inside a little bit. You got to, okay? If you want to have top tier feminine hygiene, we're not talking about basic hygiene. Hygiene. We're talking about top tier, okay? I want my girlies smelling top tier. Also, you guys, if you use any of my tips, please, 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 I'm begging you, um, come back, update me, tell me how your life has changed since. Uh, um, taking my advice because I know your life gonna change. I know you're gonna walk around feeling yourself, okay? Because the worst thing um, someone could go through is just have bad hygiene. You know what I'm saying? That's the worst. So, I, you know, you guys know I love you and I just want to help you guys in any way possible. Also, comment below what other Girl Talk videos you would like for me to do next. Any topic, I don't care. You guys know I'm open and honest and I'm just willing to help, okay? Even if it's TMI, even if it's embarrassing, let me know, girl. Like, comment below, and I'm gonna do a video. I got you. Back. Love and Natural is back. She's back. I'm back, and I'm ready. I'm back, and I'm ready to give you guys this bomb advice. Okay. Um, am I missing anything? Oh, for perfume, me, I use the YSL Libre perfume. So after you have washed your body, right? After you have washed your clothing and some good laundry, laundry detergent with some fragrance on it, like I said, to for your clothes to smell good. Oh, very important. Make sure. Me, I go to Bath and Body Works. Let me see if I, I can show you guys. Let me sh show y'all. Okay. I use cucumber. I use cucumber melon um, body lotion. And I have the body spray. Let me show you. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all. So when I get out the shower, 
I lather my body up with some lotion that smells really good. And then I go in with a body spray. And then once my clothes is on, then I go in with a perfume. My perfume of choice is the YSL Libre. I also like Burberry Her. Just whatever fragrance that smells really, really good to me. But my favorite is YSL Libre. I spray it on me. And then I'm out the door smelling and looking good. I'm talking about, ladies, if you take my advice, when I tell you, you're going to be smelling so good that everywhere you go, it's just going to attract so much attention. Excuse me, miss. What are you wearing? Yo, I remember I went on a date and um, I sat down at the bar. I just, I literally just sat down and the bartender was like, oh my gosh, like, what are you wearing? And I was like, thank you, girl. Why so Libre? Little do, little do she know, like, it's so many steps that you got to take so you can smell delicious and sweet all day long, okay? This is not, this is not for the week. This hygiene, uh, this high, my hygiene, uh, routine is not for the week, okay? It's steps, it's levels to this, okay? But, like I said, you do everything I said in this video. After you, after you come out the shower, you lotion up, body spray, put your clothes on and add a perfume. Top tier. You're going to smell so good. You're gonna be so happy that you came across this video, I promise. But anyways, I've been I've been talking y'all ear off. Let me go, child. Let me go. I love y'all.